All right, we got this ignition switch from a 9.5 plastic one. Pull these two things out. Take the cap off. Slide this assembly out of this little container. And this piece here, which is what the ignition switch turns, it's got a little spring in it, a detent. And if you look closely, there's a ramp on it that engages with these four little spring pins, which push through these four holes, which line up with these four copper, the copper part, not the spring part. The spring part is actually pushing that little contact that it makes with the wiring on the other side. So it looks like if this ramp, either the ramp is bad on this part, or if the springs aren't, I guess the pins aren't pushing against those four holes, which I don't see how that could be, because those actually, by default, would keep this normally open, and it's only when the pins are not pushing on it that the contacts would be made. So it looks like that's where the problem would be is those little those little contacts, the little ball sized contacts, contacts. So if those don't make, then that's where the electricity is not passing through. It looks like you can take this apart if you wanted to clean those contacts. There's, uh, let's see, it's right on this side. They've got three small plastic rivets or welds right there that if you were to take that apart this assembly would come apart in the middle and then you could clean those contacts and maybe even pre-bend those springs a little bit more to give it a little more push